and gents, I uh, just want to give you a quick demonstration on how you patch in a pixel map into your show uh, to enhance your effects, make it look pretty cool, everyone likes pixel map. So what I'm going to do is show you how really quick, I reckon I can do it in under 5 minutes. Um, so uh, just quickly, I've already patched in some Chauvet colour rails on 26 channel mode, uh, which enables you to do the pixel mapping. Um, and I've arranged them so, so that they're in starts head 1 here, head 8 here, so 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8. Uh, each one of these heads has got uh, 8 individual RGB LED elements in it, so you've got 8 uh, times 2, which is 16, 16 down and 4 across. Uh, that's important as you patch your grid, so you want to hit the output button, which is here, and patch in a grid. When you first open it, it will look something like that, it might be on view channels, but you want to be in view plan hit set grid size, set the width first and then the height, so 4 by 16 which I've already done um, and that gives you this output, the, uh, this screen that we've got here so now we want to select the RGB elements which is what's going to give our colours um, and go back to our outputs highlight all of that by clicking and dragging across and set insert heads, now the way that we've got them arranged is vertically not horizontally so you want to have vertical there like that and hit patch pixel map click yes and I typically set the number of layers of three so you can do a bit of colour mixing and stuff like that so there's three layers and there it is patched in so if you now go to your um, view heads you've got your generic bitmap patched in here it's in your groups so how do you get it working well it's really freaking easy we want to go to the media section and this is where our bitmap control is. Uh, you want to explore this a little bit, probably do a bit of uh, RTFM on this if you don't really know what you're doing. Uh, first I'm going to hit locate which turns the pixel mapper on. I'm going to turn the dimmers on. There we go. So you don't really need to worry about this palette and this palette. You need to worry about having the dimmers turned on on each one of these uh, heads and have your bitmap located which turns on the bitmap. Now I'll go back to your media output and uh, you've got automatically you've got multiple layers selected so typically what I'll start with is just clearing it off why has that got a colour coming up? ah that will have a colour coming up because it hasn't been told not to there we go so go back to our media page look it's now a blank frame here which gives us our output and you've got all of these nice different options Sorry, you need to have a layer selected before you can. Excuse me. Select your bitmap and then go to your media because it knows what you're referencing there. Layer 1, and look at that. Pixel mapping is controlled. As I said before, do a little bit of RTFM with this, have a play with it. Uh, I think you've got some different media inbuilt. You can also put your own in. Uh, these are some vid bitmap videos or GIFs or GIFs or however you want to pronounce it. It has a pretty cool effect and you can play with those, change the colours of those, speed and everything. But there you go, that's how you uh, do some pixel mapping. If you've got any questions then feel free to uh, comment on here or send me a quick message. Don't forget to subscribe and I hope this has helped you out a little bit. Take care dude. Bye.